honestly, I, the kids will be amazed to have this. I think it's a, it will be the benefit for the future. I believe that AR and AI are just fundamental skills to learn now for the future. It's something that we need to we need to increase our learning, especially teachers and educators. We need to be able to learn this now because in 10 years time or five years time, it's gonna be normalized. My name is Aidan Villian Weber. I'm a diverse learning coordinator for years three and four, and I come from the School of Islamic College of Brisbane. This is the best way for kids to just develop a good quality of understanding, which for all teachers in every school, our job is to give kids a better quality of learning. So my name is Nicole, I'm from St. Pat's College in Mackay. My teaching areas are in the design and technology field. I teach design, industrial graphics and furnishing skills. I think in 10 years time, I think it's going to be foundational. At the moment, everything is new, especially adopting it in the school system. Uh, so once we all become familiarised with it and it becomes normalised, I think it will be foundational later on. Hi, I'm Yang. I'm from the Islamic College of Brisbane. I'm currently the head of uh, arts and technologies in high school. So I think um, mixed reality offers opportunities for students in the sense that, um, you know, things that are dangerous, things for them to, to simulate uh, situations that they would otherwise not be able to in a normal classroom. And I think this great technology offers great opportunities. We just need to think of, you know, how to put it properly into a lesson and, and to work it out properly. The students today will be using these tools on the job in the future. That's almost guaranteed. Uh, or you know, different versions of these, uh, these, these tools, such as a, a wearable headset or a, an AR um, tablet experience. So getting in early um, and ensuring that teachers are well equipped to understand how the, the use cases, um, as well as understand how to design for these experiences so that they can then communicate that onto uh, you know, the, the, the students um, that they're working with. I recommend this to every single teacher as this will be a benefit for them if they want to provide extra, extra quality learning for their kids.